Hello again, everybody, and welcome to a new series on Pixelmon! Oh my god, I am so excited for this. I didn't think I'd be this excited to get back into the game, but oh my god, just seeing the title screen is just like, ugh! Look at this cute little cherim. And they have the- oh my god, and it's in 1.19, or 1.20, which is insane. Wait, is that true? No. No, that's- that's fake. Okay. <laughs> Never mind, I got really excited, but what is it actually in? 1.16, that's not that bad. We got the nice nether. I remember the old Pixelmon mods were in, packs were in 1.12, so I am happy with 1.19. Anyway, Hicks, Hicks we go. I don't, I was thinking the word Pixelmon as I said, here we go. I don't think this makes a difference because if I'm remembering correctly, mobs don't spawn, but I'll put it on hard anyway. Allow cheats off, survival. And we're ready to go. Anyway, so the goal for the series could make it really, really... Oh, I have no idea what starter I'm picking. Oh, should I pick one of the new ones? The Gen 9 ones? I can't believe they already made those into the game. Um, Yeah, the goal for the series is to get the entire... Oh, there was a shiny in there. That was funny. Get the entire Pokedex. Actually, there's a different thing, but I'll talk about it in a second. Oh, boy. Okay. Here we go. So, of course, this is the, the core three. Of course. Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle. By the way, I get all of my picks, my Pokemon knowledge from this game. Like, I grew up playing this. Um, I went with Sobble one time, and I hated it. There it is. It's the worst emo. It, like, evolves into something. I can't remember. It was stupid. My friend told me to pick it, and I hated it. I also just don't love water types. I always go fire type, though, because it just is good. Like, fire is good against a lot of stuff. Fire is good against grass. It's good against ice. It's good against rock, right? It's just good against a lot. Grass is good against water. And a few other things. And water's just, I don't know, water just always disappoints to me i kind of want to go with one of the new ones just for fun or like stay ah oh, turn twig into torterra i love torterra mm, this is so hard i should have thought about this before I, before i started the video um okay i do love chimchar which evolves into the monkey one i don't remember there's a lot of stuff I don't remember. Could have a Blaziken. I did Fennekin before. Uh, and got Delphox. It was like the last time I played Pixelmon, I think. Could have Typhlosion. Could have the new ones. See, I don't even know the new ones. So I kind of want to do the new ones. Fuecoco. It lies on warm rocks and uses the heat absorbed by its square-shaped scales to create fire energy. Oh, man. I think I'm going to go with Fuecoco. Yep. Oh, it's so difficult to click on this. We're going to get all of them eventually, so we can always switch. Here we go. Okay, what do we got frames-wise? Let the world generate. There's a Ponyta. Hello. Is that an Ultra Beast? Golurk. No, that's not an Ultra Beast. There's a Meowth. I started in a village, which is really nice. I don't know if it does that every time or not. Um, Looking good. Okay, looking good. I like that we have biomes aplenty in here, which is super cool. We got like fun trees and things. Got an electric. Yeah, there's like weird trees everywhere. What do these do? Do it? Can I? Oh, that doesn't do anything. I wonder how sound is against my voice. Let me let me do like sound check and everything. So let me just destroy a bunch of. Hey, level twenty five electric. Yeah, right. No. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Well, that was quick. Anyway, sound check, sound check, sound check, sound check against my voice. Let's check it out. I'm also going to experiment with making my frames a little bit better. Look at all these Wooloos over here. Holy crap. Whole pack of Wooloos. Okay. Um, anyway. Yeah, we'll just set up here. This is cool. Where are the... There's like berries everywhere. Oh. Hello? I don't know how 
Any of this works. Okay, you want to fight me still. What's up with you, dude? Okay, I'm gonna check the sound and yeah, we'll see we'll see how it goes. Sound levels are good. It looks like frames just take a little bit of time to to get there. Um one thing I am gonna do is actually go on normal, maybe even easy, because since it's not gonna make a difference besides how fast my hunger depletes, I don't wanna have it on hard, because that would just make food really annoying. Cell battery. Okay, so anyway, let's get started. Uh, our Fue Coco is dead, unfortunately. Let's check him out real quick. So I've never really gone super into like the stats or anything. Like I've never really understood anything about uh, like these. I know that these are EVs and then they also have IVs. Um, so we've got 22 HP, 11 attack, which is his best. Eight special defense, which is his lowest. Um, I don't know what's high. So, yeah. Anyway. Uh, and then I could do, like, IVs 1. Which, they, he's halfway. Okay. So, that's good to know. Is this a PC? Yes, it is. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's trading. I might have to, like... What is that, a box? There's healers. Um, I might have to... Uh, oh, what did I do to the map? The map's weird. Okay. Um, I don't even remember what I was going to say. I have a bed. Let me chop a tree down instead of a house. Um, yeah, I have no idea what I was going to say. Oh, I see. Those, those trees now grew fruit. Okay. Let's, let's see what we can do there. Um, Anyway, so the goal of this series is to um, not only complete the Pokedex, but get a shiny legendary. Now, the purpose of completing the Pokedex would be to get a shiny charm, which I feel like is probably the only way we'll get a shiny legendary. If we get a shiny legendary before completing the Pokedex, just by chance, um... I'm not going to end the series because that would be stupid. So I think we're going to just go for complete Pokedex and then after completing Pokedex, get a shiny legendary. And that's what we're going for. Of course, that means the series is going to be very long, uh, probably longer than my, yoink, probably longer than my, um... oh, you know what I need? I know it's wrong. Something's wrong, right? Where Where is that? Sensitivity, right? I feel like... Yes. I feel like I, I play on like 90 or something. Because it seems fast. Nope, that seems slow. Okay. I think it's maybe because I'm playing on full screen and I usually don't. That's the one thing I want to figure out is how to launch the game in... Uh, in 1600 by 900 because I feel like that would help my frames a little bit. Not that they're bad. They're like 100 right now. Or they were when I was underground. Up top it's a little lower. But anyway... Um, yeah, so, oopsies, okay, that's stupid, let's just do that, okay, what was that? Nature's Compass, interesting, I wonder what that does. Got a lot of new stuff I'm excited about, I did not know that this is, like, it was updated and everything, that's gonna be pretty freaking cool, because I love this game, it's one of my favorite mod packs ever, and what the heck, okay, that grew into a thing. Gotcha. Um, anyway, yeah, so I really have very little experience with the actual, like, training. I haven't done any... Why did I just do that? I haven't done any breeding or anything in this. What is that? Daycare? Okay, we got we got crazy stuff going on. Um, yeah, so I haven't done, like, any of the breeding or anything like that. Uh, so I really don't have a very extensive knowledge. All I've ever really done is just played and tried to catch all the Pokemon. And I've never actually successfully done it. However, I've never actually, uh, like, tried to that hard. I've never really gotten super into it. So that's what this series is for. We're going to do everything that makes it so that we can get every Pokemon. And I'm sure we'll be learning stuff along the way because... There's clearly a lot that I need to learn. I have no idea what I'm looking at. 
Oh, Snubbles. There's Snubbles around. Snubble is the first shiny Pokemon I caught in Pokemon Go, or at least my current run on Pokemon Go. I can't remember if I had any when I was a kid, but I play Pokemon Go now. My uh, my campus is super heavy with Pokestops. I go to UCI in California, and they've got Pokestops literally around the entire campus. I'm sure that's pretty much the same with every college campus, but um, I wonder if... Ah, so I was accidentally increasing the zoom on the map by pressing my equal sign which is my act actually my let's see is this the map yes it is zoom in we're gonna put that on zero yeah okay so let's try to kill something with our pokemon i have it set to f yep so that works uh it should be both retrieve and send out right yeah okay let's check our guy out actually I haven't even seen him. Quaycoco. Quaycoco the chosen one. Nice. And he's small. Yeah, he is quite small. Um, Ekans is poison only, so that that's not that good. Let me see what I can do with these trees. Aha. <gasps> these are apricorns now? What? That's crazy. Not what I was expecting. Kind of inconvenient, not gonna lie. I sort of liked the old version. I was wondering why there were so many. Yeah, because they, like, can pop off like that. Can I, like, break the tree and then have them all fall? I wonder if that's possible. Like, what if I did that? So is it, like... Because that might be convenient. I could put hoppers underneath, maybe? And then have, like, an automatic farm? Yeah? Let's see what happens when the leaves break. So I'm, it looks like they grow quite fast, actually. Hi. Okay. Just learning the ropes here. Apricorn log. Well, I can plant them by going like this, right? Yes. Okay, that's correct. And you get them back now. Okay, better system, actually, maybe. Because it looks like I can do it not by hand anymore. Because you used to have to run across the top of your apricorn... Apricorn? I say apricorn. Apricorn farms to get like all of the apricorns and sometimes you wouldn't well no they used to go right into your inventory which was actually more convenient like whatever okay um i can rock with that maybe as long as they grow next to one another that's one thing uh other thing i mean maybe i don't know it might be more efficient not to break the what is that thing are there some gen nines that i don't know about le chunk <laughs> Okay, um, okay, what can we beat? A level 5 Rattata? Level 3 Rattata? Yeah, even easier. You got Ember? Bam. I'm faster than Rattata. Boom. Only took me four tries. No, it took me one. Okay, and you know what? I'm gonna, like, collect everything, because it's the only way that I can get everything. Um, what is this now? These are, like, berries or something. Oops. Rost berry. Ah, right, so you can use these for different EVs, I think. So what happens if I... This has bitterness 10, which should mean... Oopsies. Um, which should mean that if I gave it to him, his special defense went up, I'm pretty sure. No. There's five things, and there's six of these, so that can't be it. Let's see what happens if I give it to him. What? Uh, whoops. Here, bud. Come here. What? You're so small, I can't... Did that work? What happened? Oh, okay. He just devoured those. Uh... That didn't change his stats. Okay. I don't know what that did, to be honest. Whatever. Okay. Uh, it's turning night time, but we're just gonna sleep. Oh, you know what? Let's stay out for one night because maybe we can see if, by chance, things do spawn. So I don't know about this new apricorn thing because, to be honest, it might be kind of annoying to have to to have them in tree form. 
I feel like that might lead to some silly shenanigans, if you ask me. What level are you? Two? Easy, one try. Yup. Easy. Take. Um. What is that? Avoidance. Oh, we, okay, so when you fight something, you get to get away from everything else for a while. Hey. Oh, what was that? What was that sound? Heard something weird. Okay. Oh, it might have been a Zubat flying over. Um. Yeah, so apricorns on trees might be kind of annoying. Because, like, to chop them down seems like a lot of work. Although they do get chopped down fast. But then again, then you have to wait for the sapling to grow again. That's the one thing that's really setting me off about it, is that you have to actually wait for the sapling to grow again. Which is probably more difficult than if you just, like... I throw those seeds away. Um... It's probably more difficult than if you didn't chop it down. But then, how do you collect each one very efficiently? Because with chopping them down, you can make them drop on the ground and drop into hoppers, and you can make it more automatic. Uh, I don't know. Oh, look. A Galarian Zigzagoon. Oh, right. I forgot Galarian stuff spawns at night. Forget. Where is it? Galarian Zigzagoon right there. Bam. Gotta go. Oh, I can actually kill that, probably. Bonk. You're tiny. Why are you so small? Bonk. Zigzagoon is dead. Oh, it's not dead. Okay. I'll tackle you then. Goodbye. <gasps> I got level six. Oh, take that. I need bones. Um, there's a Galarian Rattata right there. Hey, bud. Level five Galarian Rattata. Let's do it. Boom. Easy. Bam. Oh, that doesn't do very much. Okay, I'll do it again. Ouch! Yes. Ooh! Cooked mutton. Not gonna... Not gonna complain about that. Very cool. Um, so then... These potions. Can I, like, go like this? Oh, cool. And then I don't have to heal. Okay, cool. Here's a... Meowth. Galarian Meowth. Right, Galarian? Right. Alolan? I can't remember. There's a bunch of different forms of everything. Okay, let's clear this out real quick. Oh, this actually takes a while to break down. Can I turn these into wood? That's what I want to know. Whoa! Oh! Interesting! That I did not expect. Okay. Let's plant all these. Why not? Might make potatoes my main crop. What is over here? Got more. Oh, there's, okay, here we go. Uh, there's carrots, that's nice. Any potatoes? Yeah, we got potatoes. Okay, cool. So we'll keep those potatoes there. What do we got, berries? Yeah. I don't know what they do. <laughs> so I'll, I'll figure that out later. Anyway, looks like, yes, mobs still don't spawn in this pack, so that's cool. There's a Zora. Okay, so we obviously want to establish farms and a steady source of Pokeballs right away. Because, oh, so things spawn in packs now. That's cool. I like that. Because it was kind of weird to just see one of each thing, like, sitting around. Um, I also don't know if, like, shinies still have particles. So hopefully we'll see one and then realize that they do or don't uh yeah so we want to find a place to actually settle down i think we'll just do it here uh for now we might as well just live out of this this pokestop because it's got a healer and a pc and everything like that so it's kind of like the first first stop that we that we want i'm just gonna do this in order to make it my home and my home only everybody stay out of here we're gonna bonk, 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 and then make a little door out of the remainder. Of course, we don't have enough. There you go. Pink. Cool. Okay, so we live here now. So the ones that you have to evolve by trading. Oh. oh interesting. It's obviously teaching me how to make something. Shut up. Uh, the ones that you have to do by trading. What? What are you? Oh. Oh. Okay. Cool. I can click on her. Um. Yeah, I keep getting off my train of thought. The ones that you have to evolve by trading, I'll probably just cheat. 
because obviously I can't actually do that since I don't I'm not playing on a server so oh well there you go that's like a chest all right let's see what that makes this is a legit like actual chest so I might as well just use this for now I'm gonna make it float um I kind of want to destroy this mm, I don't know let me let me let me decide on some things real quick let me let me destroy this tree real quick yeah do that get some extra wood and then I'll use this wood and create a little loft for myself by going like this just a quick little makeshift shelter I'm gonna go bonk 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 oops 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 what the heck I couldn't place it on there Ah, stop it. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay, and then we'll have a little way to climb up the back. Don't want that. Or that. Uh, we'll use these to make more sticks. Like this. And just make a few ladders. And we'll just have a nice little way to climb up right... Here. Right. Yeah, sure. Bonk. Okay. Oh, that's not convenient. What just opened my door? Oh, that's very not convenient. You know, okay, never mind. We're not doing it there. Um I don't know how Minecraft works anymore. I haven't played in a long time. Bonk. We're gonna put that back, actually. And then actually create might as well put the whole thing back. The whole dang thing. Get out of my house, man. I don't like that they can open doors. Uh, I don't know what is going to happen if I do that, so I'm not going to do it just yet. But I will want the ladder here eventually. So that I can get up. Can this guy leave me alone? Who is he? Who does he think he is? Um, We got another that up here. And then I can make, like, no more. That's inconvenient. Uh, what do you want? Okay. You need to feed five different Pokemon to, for me. Oh. Okay, did he do that? My, okay. Uh, weird. I'm gonna place the box down real quick so I can just store a bunch of random crap. Um, yeah. I'm just gonna put all the, oh, keep that on me. Potions and stuff. What does it do? 20? Nice. And these seeds. I'll eat this. Okay. Why do days seem faster? That, se that seemed really fast. I don't know. Okay. Uh, Let's chop down this tree over here. What is this? Oh, those are berries. More berries. Yeah. So obviously we won't want to live here, like we'll make a house and everything nice, but um, like eventually, and we'll probably be in one of these really cool biomes somewhere. So we'll have to go out and explore sometime soon. But for now, uh, what gave me bones? I don't even remember. It was the Zigzagoon. So let's fight more Zigzagoons before the sun comes up because they give me bones, and I like that, because I want bones. Hey, bud. Bonk. Ouch, this guy strikes first. It hurts. It hurts. I'm level seven now, yay. I don't know what the grass mail is. Also, did that guy write down what he wanted from me? Round. Bonk. Oh, that doesn't do very much. Ow. Okay. Oh, no, I'm dead, okay. Whoopsies. Let's go back and heal. You know what? I'm gonna just do this right now because I know I'll want it later. <laughs> so, might as well just break a hole in the side there. Um, okay, all these zigzagoons. The other one didn't strike first. There we go. Ouch. Back him. Yoink. I don't know what grass mail does. I don't 
know where the look at okay so how how inconvenient is this really gonna be like if i go like this you know it honestly wouldn't surprise me if there was actually an automated way to do it as well um okay so obviously we want to go find we want to go out and explore and find like a black one so that we can or like just every type so that we can yeah there's one right there uh so that we can like bring it all back home so i'm gonna chop this one down boom 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 like that and i'll wait there's another black one there the zigzagoon wants the smoke tackle it's weird that what okay so that did 30 percent of his health and this is gonna do what Oh, a lot. Well, no, that also did 30. So it doesn't... It's weird, because Ember is 40. Oh, don't kill me. You totally killed me. With three health left, that's so annoying. I eat this? Oh, I totally can! That's awesome! Okay. Um... Yeah, so I'm waiting for this to fall down. Look at that tiny mouth. Look at all those! Nice! So we want one of every color. And then we're gonna plant them all next to each other to try to create a nice farm. And then we'll see about everything after that. I guess we don't have to chop them down as we find them. So we have green, red, and black already. There's a blue one right here. Look at this. That is some, those are some cool... I don't like that, that I have to have an open hand. Um. Those are some cool trees right there. We got a smoliv instead of an olive, I see. Very, very creative. Good job, guys. The creation. The zigzagoon. I don't like that bug. I don't like how they keep chasing you even after they've defeated you. That's super annoying. We've got this white one. And that. Wait, that's all. No, there's pink. There's pink somewhere. There's seven different ones, right? Yeah, that would make seven if I found a pink one. Well, I don't really need pink just yet, so. Dang, these things are fast. I can't even get away from it. There's so many pie doves everywhere, dude. <laughs> Look at all these pie doves. Okay. Yeah, this looks like is still with me. I'm gonna... Ow! What? Wasn't expecting that. Did that guy write down my quest for me? Are there like, is there like a slash quests thing that I don't know about? No, I don't know. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna heal so that we can fight the Zigzag again and hopefully defeat it this time. Here we go. We're just gonna only do those. Boom. It's gonna kill me again. I feel it. Yep, there it is. I got it down to three again, and it kills me. Oh, it used a status attack. Wait, I missed, though. Oh, my God. The Zigzagoon is giving me grief. It's giving me grief. Hey, bud. Yep, we're fighting again. Okay. Uh, What does Leer do? I forget what it does, and it doesn't tell you. Hmm. Let's find out. Leer defense is decreased. Okay, let's... Uh, it does do a lot more damage, but it's not going to help that much because I'm dead again. <gasps> I did it! Let's go for Coco! Good job! I guess he used a status move that time, too. And then I did 57% of his health. Let's go! Okay. Let's try to set up farms. Let's get rid of some of the current trees and things. Um... I will gra I'll raise this farm, maybe. Uh, this is like flatter right here, so I'll do it right here. Oh, look, a boss. Nice. I want to see like a legendary boss so that I know if... Um, if the shiny particles are still a thing. I'm not totally sure. Oh, there's a lot of wood here. This is going to be nice. This was the farm that I was using, though. <laughs> Kinda stupid. Uh, how far down does it go? Nice. Okay, we'll get a lot of wood from this, which is good. We need it. Wonder if there's like special rain Pokemon spawning right now. Probably. It's always like like weather affected spawns and stuff like that. 
pretty fun. Okay. Um, yeah, so we're kind of already nearing the end of the episode, and we really haven't done very much. So I might just make the first episode a special long one. Uh, because I feel like we should probably get more done in the first one. So we've got a little base set up, but I want to make farms at least, and then like a couple Pokeballs maybe, so we do need to go mining as well. Um, there we go. Now we got a lot of wood. Perfect. Got our bread out. Oopsies. Okay. Well, that's not what I meant to do. Um, let's toss those. You know what? Just move this. It's fine. I'll move it somewhere else. Let's just bonk, bonk. Hey. Got that that can happen. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay. I need this dirt to fill in the holes on the side. See, was that enough? Probably not. Oh, almost. Get a little more from up here. Okay, I don't want to throw these out. I don't remember doing that. The rain looks different in this pack for some reason. It's like a little shiny. Shiny? Shiny? <laughs> um. Where did I want to throw out those? Yes. Bing, 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 bing. Oopsies. Okay. So, now, we're gonna go grab all of these off the ground over here. Yoink. So, we want black and yellow the most, then red and white also the most. So, what we're gonna do is set up a little kind of, like, farm sort of situation here. See, I don't know what the most efficient way of doing this would be. I don't know if it's good to put them all together. I feel like not, because then that gets rid of surface area for the leaves to spawn. So it's probably like this. So I'm going to do it in rows of eight, since I have eight of these. Um, the trees grow to be that wide, so pacing them two apart would probably be the best option. Oopsies. Let's do that. So like this, I'm guessing something like this would be like the most efficient farm sort of action here. Bam, oops, bam, and bam. Okay, and then we'll do the same thing with red ones like this. We'll go bam, bam. Bam, 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 and bam. Just like that. And we're going to want two rows of red, so we'll just clear that hill there. It doesn't go very far, right? Maybe I'll just go up the hill. Yeah, because it's kind of hilly over here. Might just go up the hill. Um, we'll go, we'll get this close to the... Okay, so one already grew. That's good. Oops. That was weird. Okay. Ah, <clears throat> oh, crap. That's annoying. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. Um. There you go. So we'll see how this turns out. I have no idea how it is going to turn out. We're going to put, like, torches every once in a while, because I'm sure they need light to grow. And my time is already falling, once again. Um, okay, so they do go grow quite fast, and now we have some bones, too, so I kind of want to do this. <clears throat> and just kind of test this is out. So that doesn't work. Interesting. Hmm. I think maybe, yeah, I think maybe just letting them grow all the way and then chopping them down is going to be the most efficient way of doing it. In which case, I could probably do like a water tree farm, probably. That's sort of like, you chop, it, you chop the trees down and then the things fall into water. So it would kind of be like this, where there's water... 
uh, underneath, like down here, and then it runs underneath like a platform that's kind of like this. So some things would fall on that, <clears throat> and then also replanting would be difficult. So we'll figure it out in the future, but right now we're just going to do it this way. We have two rows of red ones, because red's going to be the most important right now. Uh, we also want white, which we'll just do like this. We'll do one of each of the ones that we only have one of right now, like that. Anyway, uh, we're going to go mining right under here so that all of these can grow. You can do this though, right? Yes, good. Okay, so yeah, it looks like that's probably the best way to do it. Because that gives, that lets all the leaves generate like that. And then you can just chop them down and replant. Yeah, that's that's all right. So that'll be cool. Um, yeah, let's go to bed. Oh, I forgot to plant this yellow one. Um, let's plant it right here. I don't care. There you go. And grow it. Why not? There you go. Okay, let's finish up our little base in here. And then head down to the caves. Um, we're just going to go right on up here. Okay, super annoying. Hup, nope. One more try. Bam, there you go. Uh, we're gonna pop some more oak slabs over everything. Bam, bam. I didn't realize I was creating this on a block that doesn't align. It's pretty annoying. Oh yeah, that's super annoying actually. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Um, there we go. I've made the upstairs nice and livable. Probably gonna make a bunch of chests to put stuff in for right now before we make our real base, um, which will be later. I'll put another one of those there so that this maintains its integrity. Yeah, looks good. Looks looks good, uh, except for that, of course. But whatever. This isn't a permanent base, so anyway, let's throw our crafting table down right there. Let's just pop a furnace down too, as well. Um, might as well do this too, I don't know, just before I leave. Uh, and then let's also make a bunch of chests out of this. Let's, there you go. Um, we're gonna go bam, 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 bam. Oh, I don't need that many. Well, I don't... I don't not need that many. Might as well just do that. And just spam a bunch of stuff in there right now. All the stuff that I don't need with me while I go mining. So that's what we're going to do now. We're going to go mining. Um, right underneath where we are. Just so that we can... So that we can get some resources, including an anvil and a hammer, of course, because that's the main thing that we need in order to make Pokeballs, in order to start catching Pokemon. I figured out how to look at my quests, by the way. This guy asked me to get to defeat a Feraligator, a Shieldon, an Ursa Luna. I'm not counting Roly, Roly Coley in this, like, incredulous tone, because that's not that hard, but the other ones, insane. Feraligator is the fully evolved form of uh, Totodile. Shieldon is a fossil. Ursa Luna is the evolved form of... The nighttime evolved form of, uh... Who? Teddy Ursa. Yeah, so that's... Those are some pretty tough things. Hey, who are you? LeChonk? You're done. You're done, LeChonk. You're gone, dude. Ooh. Pork chops. And a tiny mushroom can be sold to shopkeepers. I forgot that I can sell things. That's right. Is there a shop here? There's no shop here. There's just the Pokestop. I just realized that. Hmm, that's disappointing. Just... Oh, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to sell stuff to you, but you don't take anything, do you? Okay, well, whatever. Uh, I'm not going to keep it on me. I'm just going to toss it. Okay. Yeah, we're going to go right underneath here. Unfortunately, we aren't in an update of Minecraft where there will be nice, cool caves. Unless there's a mod that makes 
cool caves, but we'll see when we get down there, I suppose. I see a score bunny on the map, which is unfortunate. Oh, yeah, let me look at... Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. I can do this, right? Yes. Home. 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 Save. Beautiful. Okay, now we'll never get lost, because we can see that on the, on, with our own eyes. With our own eyes. We're going down to get some iron. Wow, that was fortunate. 1.16 still had ore iron? Oh yeah, it was 17 that added the, the raw iron and gold, isn't it? That's surprising. Oh yeah, and I also have no means of light right now. I totally forgot about that. Hmm. Okay, well, we're just winging it. Down we go. Let's see if we can find a cool cave. We'll, we'll, we'll find out. I don't know. I really want to find coal first, actually, because I can barely even see, let alone you guys. I'm sure it's way darker on YouTube than it is here. Um, what is that? What is this? Soapstone. Okay. Not what I'm trying to find. I'm trying to find a cave. Hello? Oh, more iron. Well, that's good. We do need as much iron as possible because we want to make discs. Uh, once we get... Hello? No, I can't get that yet, can I? I don't know what that is. I think that's aluminum. Um, I totally forget... Yeah, it is pretty difficult to, like... What is that? Okay, I need to make a... Give me a second here. I need to do this. Let's start cooking some stuff up. Okay. Yeah, I can't get either of these things right now. Nor can I get that, probably. <laughs> yeah. I can't remember if it's actually difficult or not to, like, get the stuff for Pokeballs. I think the hardest part was getting iron. And that's not that big of a deal when... Oh, right. But there's no raw raw iron yet, so you can't get... You can't get fortune and make it easier. I felt like it wasn't that difficult to make Pokeballs, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> that was stupid. Okay, well, that's not what I meant to do, but sure. Iron base. Didn't you have to hammer those yet before? Or do you still? No, you totally did, didn't you? Yeah, you had to make discs in the bases. Okay, well, I'm kind of glad that they changed that, I'm not going to lie. Because that was sort of annoying to have to do before. Okay. Actually make a pickaxe this time. I'm sure you still have to... To hammer the... The other things. Okay, what is this? Bauxite. Does bauxite smelt into aluminum? I totally forget. I don't know what this ore does, to be honest. I know that the other thing is amethyst, which is kind of like an iron stand-in. Which is pretty nice. Because you can get fortunate and it gives you a lot. Okay, this is silicon. Gotcha. Yeah, you can fortune these, and they kind of are as strong as iron, so they're pretty good. Because they're kind of easy to find. Oops, let me keep mining with this. Okay, so we made... We need an anvil. Not like the normal Minecraft anvil, but instead a... An anvil... That can make Pokeballs. I remember that there's like an automatic anvil in the game as well. Um, so we want to get enough stuff to do that. But maybe not right now. We can do a lot of stuff by hand right now. We just want some Ultra Balls, some Pokeballs, some Great Balls maybe. Great Balls are blue and yellow. No, blue and red. Blue and yellow is di uh, Quick Balls. Dive Balls are blue and pink. I remember most of them, but not all of them. There's a Zigzagoon down here? That's weird. Let's see if I can get to 11. Oh yeah, I forgot how easy it is to get to the bottom of Minecraft before. Oh look, gold. Nice. Okay. We still didn't get any coal going all the way down. We're like almost to the bottom now. We didn't get any coal. I do see like... What is that? Is that also soapstone? Oh, that's like a redstone. Scoria cobblestone. Interesting. I do see, like, on the map, I see... 
That. We could get over there pretty easy, right? Where am I? 560 and 13. Or no, 560 and 48. And this is 626 and 35. No, that's actually really far away. <laughs> we'll go there eventually, but not today. Okay, all we want is enough for an anvil, and I kind of forget the recipe for it, I'm not going to lie. So, we might already have enough, but I wouldn't know because I don't have any iron on me, and I don't have a crafting table with me. So I can't check the recipe. Oh, okay, we're already below diamond level, so we're going to stop for now. We didn't find a cave, which is unfortunate because we wanted a cave. Um, because those are better than looking for everything manually by strip mining it's definitely more entertaining to be in a cave uh we got a little bit more iron i'm just gonna throw all these random stones away i just picked them all back up but okay okay i got all of that back um right all right so let's go back up with what we found we only have seven iron which is definitely not enough uh i can't remember if you can make a stone hammer if so then i might be able to make it some like let's see can you make a stone hammer you can okay cool uh a an anvil what huh Wasn't it like, like, uh-oh, I totally forget it. <laughs> um, okay, we're going to look it up real quick. Pixelmon, and, oh, Pixelmon Anvil. Anvil, Pixelmon. Crafting, okay, it is eight, and I have seven. That's so unfortunate. All right, Wow. Hey, okay. That's very nice to see uh, that everything grew so well. Um, all right, I'll do... You know what? We're going to end the episode here. We did do a bit. We got, we got like, a little established little house here, which is good. Um, yeah, next episode, I'm going to come back, and we'll, I will have already found more iron and maybe a cave. We can start in a cave. And then... Uh, we'll catch some Pokemon. Some of our first Pokemon. We gotta fill out this Pokedex. We have nothing. We've seen. Yeah, we've s caught. Oh. What do you mean I've caught a Rattata? Liar. You're lying to me. Oh, oh, okay. That's total. I see. <laughs> So when we see them, we'll, they'll pop up here with their little icon, but the description doesn't happen until we actually catch them. So, yep, next episode we're going to start catching some Pokemon and solidifying our farms. It's going to be great. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've all enjoyed. Until next time, have a great day and goodbye.